Good morning friends, Merry Christmas, welcome to day two of the festive 500 mus. I hope you're all good, Christmas day, woohoo! So good to see you friends on this Christmas day. It's just gone 10 a.m. I'm actually feeling pretty tired. I didn't get much sleep. Um, my son was out in town. He rang me at half past two to say, Dad, can you come pick me up? I was in such a deep sleep. And I said, yeah, I'll just get dressed, etc. blah, blah, blah. Anyway. 25 minutes later I turn up at the where he's meant to be in town and he's not there and there's a massive fight breaking out between loads of people hanging about outside a kebab shop and I'm thinking oh my days and then I saw a young lad I don't know if he was laying on the floor or sitting on the floor I guess he must have been involved in the fight that had just taken place just before I turned up and um, people sort of round him, asked him if he was all right and stuff. And I was thinking, oh my days, I hope that's not Lewis. Thankfully it wasn't, but um, I really don't understand why people have to get like that, it's crazy. Anyway, I kept ringing him and saying, and uh, leaving him messages and he wasn't picking up. About 15 minutes later, I'm still sat in the car where I'm where he said for me to pick him up. He picks up his phone and he says, Oh, I'm in a cab, I'm on my way home. I was like, You what? You rang me to come and pick you up. And he said, No, I didn't. I mean he'd obviously had a few too many. So I uh, got back home. He had obviously got in just before me because he got the cab and um, he'd bolted the door shut so I couldn't get in. So I then had to ring him again to come and let me in because Donna and Holly were still asleep. This was sort of half past three now. And then I couldn't get back to sleep. Eventually did, about five o'clock. Then I was up at six to open the presents. Obviously Lewis was and he was still in bed, he's only just got up. So absolute nightmare, so I'm feeling a bit jaded this morning friends. My legs feel a bit heavy. You, there's nothing better than getting a really good night's sleep the night before a ride. Because if you don't, blimey O'Reilly, it really does. You really do feel it. Anyway you legends, by the time you watch this it'll be Christmas night. So I hope you've all had a cracking Christmas day with your family, friends and loved ones, whatever you've been up to. Work at a bar, I wanted to see over the other side And I had a friend, her name was Fern and she had a blue bike So we'd ride through the streets and I would sleep over on Saturday nights Then I went to school, my family moved to a village nearby I think I just got a PR guys, by one second an uphill and downhill section. Oh, if I have got it, I'll be so chuffed. Good times. I started drawing black under my eyes. Cause I met a boy. First time I kissed him, well, it was the last. So my plan for this morning's ride, friends, it's uh, just coming up to 10.53. I'm doing an extra big loop over to my in-laws and where we're going to have Christmas dinner and spend the day with them today. It's... Their house to mine is about two miles, but I'm hoping to do with this extended So it's just gone 11 a.m. Guys, just nearly 14 miles in, back on the lanes. So it should be a lot quieter. I mean, there's not a great deal of traffic. It's just people in their cars traveling around on Christmas day. So it's all good. So friends, have you had a cracking Christmas day? Did you get any awesome bike related gifts? 
let me know in the comments below I'd be really interested to hear what you got what Santa brought you I got a lovely Holly my daughter brought me an awesome DHB waterproof rollover rucksack um, I'll show you when I get to the in-laws because I've packed all my clothes in it so Donna's gonna bring it uh, take it in the car for me but it is so lovely just what I was looking for when I get the opportunity to commute into the office I can use that and it's just oh yeah just so good and Donna got me a uh, wiggle voucher which is always awesome everyone there started moving too fast these are the moments I'm missing these are the moments I never took in when I was just yeah so let me know uh, what cycling gifts you got friends and I also have to say or give a massive shout out to Ming because this morning he's riding up to Lincolnshire what an absolute legend so we set off this morning I think about 3am half past three this morning 158 miles he's spending Lincolnshire uh, Christmas up in Lincolnshire so his family drove up yesterday he's cycling up as I speak to you so by the time you watch this he should have well and truly got there I did check just before I came out and he was just south of Peterborough so he's doing Uxbridge to Lincoln 158 miles unbelievable on Christmas Day Ming that is just epic you are a legend my friend so when I pull over in a minute we'll just have a quick look at the tracker and see where he is these are the moments I'm missing these are the moments these are the moments I'm missing these are the moments okay friends live tracker is on total distance so far from Ming is 94.32 miles is that 94.92 miles he's been riding for 7 hours 11 minutes absolute legend I'm just going to zoom out of that map okay, just to see where it guys can see that but he's just north of Peterborough that is absolutely epic superb stuff Ming Okay, friends right let's crack on 11 no what am I talking about 14.3 miles done um, I was hoping to get to the in-laws for half past 11 so it's 11 14 and um, I should be absolutely fine I might just do an extra loop just to round it up to 20 miles um, right less I must say as well I did sneakily order myself a little Christmas present that wasn't meant to be coming until Friday but it arrived yesterday well they arrived yesterday so I ordered some new wheels for the Defy so I've got some Fulcrum Racing really unboxed them yet. I've had a brief look and put them back in the box so uh, we'll do a box unopening tomorrow at some stage and uh, look into them in uh, greater detail because I, as I say I've only had a brief glimpse just been so busy yesterday but all oh my days I'm so excited to get those on the Defy they should be awesome just thought I'd stop here guys because on the horizon there is a bit of kind of sunshine appearing a bit of lighter sky which is amazing how awesome I know tomorrow's meant to be um, sunny with cloud, dry, so it should be good. I'm planning on meeting up with those FCC legends, Stevie and Richie. I think we're going to be doing a leisurely Windsor Park loop, which should be cracking. So I'm so excited to uh, see those guys tomorrow on Boxing Day. Right, it's 11.26, 16.1 miles. My in-laws actually live 
where that hedgerow is there and the um, bright sky in the distance the lane that they live on runs parallel with this lane that I'm on so they're on that lane over there so I'm heading down here back out onto this sort of main B road and then looping back round to get to there somewhere over in that direction right I'll stop waffling let's go let's get these miles in for the festive 500 ooh, 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 ooh. These are the moments I'm missing In the back of her mum's car On the way to the old bars Yeah Raising my hands So I've just had to throw in An extra two mile loop Just to get it up to the 20 By the time I get to the in-laws Well I'm actually on now 19.79 So I'll just be over 20 I'm just a bit anally retentive like that Wanted to get it up to the 20 mile mark this morning <laughs> But it's all good friends i hope you're all well christmas day hasn't this year flown by i can't believe it and for the fcc and for you legends that watch the vlogs it's been absolutely brilliant i will be doing a uh, kind of end of year montage type thing I'm gonna start cracking on with that tomorrow night, I think, because there's so many amazing highlights. Riding with you lot all over the country. So good. Right, I'm coming down right, to a dance. So I'm just on the lane where the indoors live. 21.1 miles done. More than happy with that for this morning. I will see you on my nighttime return leg back home although it's not going to be as long as this probably I'll only chuck in two or three extra miles but I'll see you in a bit yeah in a skin tight short skirt 16 and we danced till her feet hurt but I had a dream hey hello friends I hope you've all had a fantastic day the time is 25 past nine on Christmas night just making my way home now. Oh my days, I've eaten so much food, it's ridiculous. So hopefully, this little ride home will make me feel better once I get indoors. It's cold, but it's not too bad. So I'm just gonna add like an extra two or three miles on to this return journey home. So it should be about five in total. We're just gonna do a few at a few extra lanes. And I'm out oh, tomorrow God. with Stevie, Richie and Ian, which should be absolutely fantastic for a Windsor Loop at 8.30 tomorrow morning on Boxing Day. So friends, thank you so much for watching once again. I hope you're all good. I hope you've had a fantastic day. I will see you in the morning. Bye for camera phone then over the time I started racking up numbers online at the end of July